Hi guys and welcome to my Barrow's Guide. Um, today I'm joined with Matt and we're going to be doing a uh, tutorial uh, demonstrating how to use how to do Barrow's without using the Void uh, Knight set. Uh, so basically here we want a, um, a mage set, obviously we both set up for mage. Um, we want a melee set, some uh, a nature runes and air runes, uh, depends what spell you're casting. Uh, as your auto cast, but um, we're just using air runes to save money. Uh, two prayer flasks, and just fill out the rest of your inventory with food. Monkfish, preferably, just because they heal for the most and they're the most value. Um, for my quick bars, I've got rack, combust, impact, and sonic wave as my general abilities. Um, but the key element here is entangle, and we're going to be demonstrating how to use this shortly to effectively kill the Barrows Brothers. Um, with without having to use much prayer, and that's why we're not filling up on prayer uh, more than we are food. Uh, next, I'll show you the melee combat bar. So basically this is dual wield. Um, you can use two-handed, it's probably more effective, but I'm going to be using dual just because it's my preference. Uh, I feel like I do a bit more damage that way. So we just got the basic abilities like Slice, uh, Havoc, Sever, Destroy is very recommended in my opinion, Assault, Overpower is probably what we're going to be using the most. and then. Because I had spare uh, bars here, I just used um, my prayers here, just to quickly um, switch in between them. Uh, and the reason I use prayers on my melee bar is because um, that's probably the only time we will be praying is when we're using melee. So, um, first of all, what I'm going to be showing you guys, I'm just going to be going off the bat here and say that you probably haven't done barriers before, uh, if you're watching this. So we're going to demonstrate how to get there. Uh, if you haven't done the prerequisite quests to get there. So um, we're in Ferret Square, obviously. Um, you can get there using just the uh, home teleport if you have the way, if you have the lightstone. Okay, um, so if memory, yeah, this, so this should be Dreox, so we'll head down here. Okay, Dreox, Dreox, it's the same thing. Okay, yeah, this is Dreox. Um, so, Matt, before you do it, uh, don't click the sarcophagus, whatever you do, okay? Right. Now, Dreox's ability is that he does more damage when his health is low, so... I'm gonna protect from melee here, just for when he initially attacks me. All right now, we want to go to our magic bar, and we want to use entangle on him. Straight up. Okay, now that he's entangled, I can walk away. God, my bar's lagging. And, oh shit. <laughs> I'm also lagging. 
for some reason. This is wonderful time, huh? Uh, okay. There we go. Okay. I hadn't even set up my autocast. So that's newbie. All right, there we go. Right. So now we just whack into him. Uh, turn off your prayer. Someone you won't need it now. fighting, though? I can't fight it because you're fighting it. Yeah, you don't You don't need to fight this. You have a separate one. I'm demonstrating first. Oh, oh I see. Okay, I'm braining. Okay. There we go. So now we've killed that guy. Right, should I kill him now? Yep, so click the sarcophagus. Pray melee first. Pray melee. Oh, boy, Pray melee. Good. I'm looking forward. Okay. Alright, now uh, snare him. Okay. Make sure you eat. Okay. Eat. Eat and working on it. Now snare him. You snare. Now run. Get away from him. There is a significant amount of life going on here. My god. Okay. Go ahead now. Wail in on him. Good hits. Good job. Keep it up. Now this is the point where you can turn off your prayer, but if you're if you're paranoid that he'll break out of storm. I don't, I don't even know how to turn off my prayer. You go into your <laughs> prayer tab and switch it off. Unless you've got it set to your bar, then you can just press it again. There you go. Good kill. All right. So now we head to the next um, the next one. So no immediate loot drops. No immediate loot drops, no. Well, uh, I'll explain that later. Okay, so middle is RMs from memory. This should be Guthans over here. brothers when you're down here, so switch the uh, corresponding prayer skill. Okay, so do I keep going through doors, or what do I do? Yeah, keep going through the doors that you can open. Yeah. Okay. I can open an 
all the doors. good if there's a long tunnel? That douche just... Uh, I'm not too sure, they have changed this a bit. Like the graphic oh, okay. Okay, hi. Alright, so now I can go through here and my... My room should be just... Okay, yep, so here we go. Here's the center room, this is where we're trying to get to. Now okay. this dick bag will stop attacking me. Oh god, what was the... So do we know which guy will be in here? No, oh. it's completely random. So you've cool. got to be ready for, for anything. So have your prayers at the ready, have your health full. Yep, we're good. So open. And go for it. Okay, so you've got Kareel's Kareel. prey, prey range, yep. Let's be careful. Prey range? Where the fuck is it? Oh, there is. Okay. Do not die! Alright, here I go. This is my turn. Who do I get? Nobody? Or do I have to wait till you- Oh no, that's right, I killed Turag, so if I search this, I get my rewards. So now the temple will shake and stuff. So basically you just wanna get out now. Search. What do I get? I got ruins, it looks like. So I should get out of house, so... Oh. Where are we going to? Vera? Vera, yep. And there you go, newbie uh, Barra's Guide. So I didn't get that much. I got uh, um, some Death Runes, some Mind Runes, and some Bolt Rack. So not the best drops, but nothing to sneeze at. Um, hope you guys enjoyed, and we'll be making more videos like this in the future. Stay tuned. Bye.